These short films you're watching were all created using AI. And as you probably know, achieving this kind of stunning quality requires a very advanced and professional video generator. But don't worry, because today I'm introducing you to an incredible tool that just got a powerful new update. I'll walk you through its different features and uh, test them out together. Besides the text to video tool, which you're already seeing amazing examples of, and the image to video option, there's also a super powerful feature designed specifically for creating short films and animated series. This tool can take up to seven reference images per video, ensuring full consistency throughout your scenes. I'm sure that with tools like these, you'll have no problem creating anime, cinematic videos, or high quality commercials. And that's not all. It also includes a template section, which is perfect for creating fun, viral social media videos. Now, I'm gonna show you three different ways to create videos and animations with this AI and compare the accuracy of each method. I'm Daniel, an experienced 2D and 3D animator. On this channel, I explore AI tools for content creation, especially in animation, and share my insights with you. So stick around. And if you enjoy this type of content, your likes and subscriptions really help us out. Just head over to uh, vidu.com through the link in the description and sign up with your email. Right on the homepage, you'll find all the tools easily accessible and ready to use. If you're into viral content, definitely check out the template section. It's super diverse and the quality is top notch. And the best part, it's super easy to use. Just upload a photo and you're good to go. There's also a separate section here for creating sound effects and it works very quickly and easily. You just need to type in any prompt you want and set the timing on the timeline and it will generate the sound you need. To make things even easier, Vidu also has a mobile app you can download directly from the homepage and use right on your phone. Next, I'm going to start with the text to video tool and test out the brand new Q1 model that was just released. And I'm really excited about this one. So as always, I recommend first taking a closer look at the sample videos and their details to better understand how this AI works and what tips to follow when writing your prompts. There are plenty of creative ideas here for both live action and animated videos and they're really engaging. You can also check out high quality projects made with Vidu in the short films. Long ago, there was but one kingdom of light. So in the text to video section, you've got um, three different models to choose from. I've already worked with the older ones before. And if you're curious, those videos are up on my channel. Honestly, I can tell you they were really good. The quality was solid and totally usable. But this new Q1 model seems to be on another level. Looks like it's way more advanced. For writing prompts, you can either use the sample ones they provided or write your own. But if you're planning to go with your own ideas, I really recommend taking a look at the user guide first. It helps a lot in understanding the prompt structure. So basically, a video prompt is made of four parts. Subject scene, description, environment, style, or medium. In each of these parts, you should clearly describe what you want to see in the video. The more specific and detailed you are, the better the results. Try not to leave anything out. Talk about materials, clothing, objects, where the characters are standing. It might sound like a lot of work, but it's totally worth it. To make things easier, there's actually a full sample prompt available. I gave that prompt to ChatGPT and asked it to give me some more ideas in the same format, and uh, it did an awesome job. Super smooth and really helpful. All right, now let's test one of those prompts. This one is in a realistic cyberpunk style. Also, just so you know, you can apply different styles to the final video, like animation styles, which I'll definitely uh, test later. Right now, uh, the duration and quality are fixed, but if you go with the older models, you'll get more options to customize. You can also tweak the movement adjustment setting. It lets you increase or decrease how much motion happens in the scene. I usually just leave it on auto and trust Vidu to figure it out. You can also change the aspect ratio and generate up to four videos in one go. Okay, let's check out the result. Honestly, the first video came out really well. I'd say it nailed it. There's nothing major to complain about and the level of detail is super impressive. 
the second one also looks great like of uh, the armor the colors the lighting all of it looks really polished the only thing is the camera movement it kind of gives it that video game cutscene vibe I changed the prompt a bit and ran it again just to show you that even if you uh, slightly go off the structure, Vidu still delivers amazing results. And honestly, this one looks incredible too. Everything is in place and it just works. Now let's try a different prompt, this time with a detective character. This one turned out awesome from the leather texture of the outfit to the character's pose and even the cigarette smoke. There are a few small issues though, like the character's eyes at the end of the video and a part of the scene where the rain doesn't hit the ground properly and it looks dry. But in the second video, everything's way better. You can really see how well it captured the whole mood. Then I made a small tweak to the prompt and ran it a third time and again, super impressive result. And before I move on to animation testing, I also generated a few more live action videos so you can get a better idea of the overall quality. They'll tell you what to do in life instead Of everything you know that you can get let them guide your life towards your now let's create an animation prompt. This one's about a bear smoking a cigarette following the same prompt structure we talked about earlier. And wow, the result is seriously impressive. The quality is just next level. According to the creators, Vidu's known for its incredible sharpness and honestly, you can totally see that here. The textures are amazing, super clean and detailed. I also generated a few more samples for different animation styles and honestly, it handles pretty much every style perfectly. For this one, I switched the style setting to uh, animation and once again, it delivered a fantastic result. I even tested out stop motion style, which is usually really tricky for most AI tools to pull off, but Vidu totally nailed it. You can actually see how the character feels like it's made out of those classic stop motion puppets, the details, the movement, everything is on point. It's super impressive and shows how far this tool. All right, now we're going to test model Q1 in the image to video tool. And there's a special option here that's honestly amazing. You can actually upload the first and last frame and Vidu will generate the full animation in between just by using a simple prompt or even without any prompt at all. It's exactly like the samples you're seeing here. Let's try regenerating one of them and check out the result. I was seriously blown away. Like it's just insane. The water simulation and the level of detail Q1 has when animating characters, it's absolutely mind blowing. I can confidently say it's hard for any other tool to compete with Vidu when it comes to this feature. I also tried generating a few animated scenes both with and without prompts. And as you can see, the results are consistently awesome. Now let's talk about the next part, reference in video. Even though this section doesn't support the new Q1 model yet, it's still super useful and delivers high quality results. You can easily upload images of your characters, objects, or locations as references and just refer to their file names inside the prompt. The result is super clean and accurate. It keeps the consistency really well throughout the video. What's even cooler is that you can upload multiple angles of the same character or object. That way the AI gets a better understanding and the accuracy goes up. And yes, like you're not limited to just two or three references. You can use more than three reference images, which is a huge advantage when working on animations or short films. Right here, I'll test a scene using four different references so you can see just how powerful this tool really is. Now in terms of pricing, Vidu also seems super cost effective. There's a free plan and even the paid plan doesn't eat up too many credits. Like with just $8 a month, you can generate up to 200 videos, which is honestly a fantastic deal. All right, that's it for now. Stay creative and I'll catch you in the next.